another episode of Fraud and Brewery. We're in Hooker Brewing in Bloomfield. I was in the one previously in Hartford, and I had a great time, so I figured why not visit the other one? This is where I spent most of the majority of my time when this came out, when this place opened a couple years back. It's gone through a number of changes, and they, they've done so many tremendous beers. Let's keep it rolling. So the first one is a Tropical Storm, and this is a New England IPA. Hazy as hell, which I like, and this is 6.7. Cheers. Salud. Skull. That tastes like pineapples. I love it. I love pineapples. If you love pineapples, then you will love this beer. It's amazing. It's delicious. All right, so this one is Hit by Pitch Pale Ale 4.5. This is what they give to the, um, the that team in Hartford. The goal, what is Yard it? Goats. Yard Goats. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Not really flavorful as the first one. Good for a pale ale, but I went from a pineapple to a bleh. So maybe I should have switched the order, but this is still good for a pale. If you like something boring and basic, get that one. So the next one is a blonde. Uh, this is the blonde ale right here. I remember when this first came out and then I, me and my producer went to a liquor store and we were like, do you have any hookers back there? And this was before this place was popular in a liquor store and the guy was like, and he could have taken it as hookers or just a hooker bond. Blonde hooker, why not? Just as I remember it, super crisp, refreshing. You know, it's something that you just want to have like a, like if you could eat it with food, you could just have a good time with it. This is the one for you. So that blonde hooker, so good. So the last one is the Trillo. And this one is, an IPA, it's a hazy IPA. Look at that number. 6.3. Here we go. Not into that one. I didn't really like the aftertaste on that one. It, it tasted. It didn't have. It just didn't have what I want. I'm not a fan of that one. That's probably the one that I don't like. But the rest of these, I would have to say. I'm gonna give it an A. Taste is subjective. This place has been around for a while. Come visit, come hang out. Look at all the stuff that's happening. It's getting bigger by the moment. They're even making beer for yard goats. You know, if you like a bunch of yard goats. And brought out.